Hi, I'm Dominic. And I'm Kevin. And we're the, the Pines Estate Boys. <laughs> shows our personality. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dominic. And I'm Kevin. And we're the, the Pines of Dave Boys. Today, we're going to show you how we take these curtains and turn them into... Pillows! So... <laughs> Get it? So? Like a pillow? <laughs> <laughs> Today, we're gonna to talk about how we took curtains and made them into pillows. We were in Home Goods, which is one of our favorite stores to go shopping in. They have great deals and sales all the time. And we found these curtains that I was talking to you about, these curtains right here, because we were initially going to hang them in our dining room. But then once we finished our dining room, we realized that we didn't need to hang curtains because there's no view of houses or anything like that Trees. outside of our windows. So we're like, why close them up? There's no need to close them up. Plus we really enjoy how open it is and letting all the light shine in. We took some of the curtains and turned them into pillows for our built-in bench. What? Well, initially, we went to Kohl's, which is another one of our favorite stores, and we bought these pillows. Kohl's, which we really love, has sales. Then you get other sales on top of that if you use your Kohl's card. Then you get something called Kohl's Cash. So I think we bought four or five of these pillows, and I think they were initially like 40 or $50 a piece. And by the end of it all, with all the discounts that we got and our Kohl's Cash, we ended up spending like 40 or $50 total for all of them. So always look for the deals. Never pay full price for anything. It's not worth it. Unless you really love it, it's one of the kind. We ended up making these pillows. We had never made pillows before. We had so much fun. We laughed quite a bit. There was a moment when uh, we were working with the sewing machine and Kevin didn't know how to pull the thread. Oh, yeah. It's been a while. <laughs> it's been a while since I used the sewing machine. And you learned on the ship. Yeah. yeah. So on the ship, we, there's sometimes we have some spare time. I took that spare time and I decided to learn something new. Our seamstress on there, our wardrobe supervisor, taught me the basics and voila. Thank you. Yeah, he knows how to sew and I know how to stop. Yeah, well. <laughs> right, we bought two sets of two, these Arcadia window panels, where we're going to take half of them, the top half and make them curtains, and the bottom half to make them matching pillows. Right now we're trying to measure out, we need 54 inches for the curtain, and then the rest will go towards pillows. The goal is to make four pillows out of this, but I think we're gonna have 20 for rectangle shaped pillows. You can see in the back, I already bought four pillows, but I might return them. I bought them at Kohl's. I really, really like them, but I just don't think they're gonna match. So I kept the tags on them. So we can make these and then see what this looks like. So I bought stuffing in the shape, basically, of the pillow that I wanna make. And then we'll just sew them up and see what happens. Here we go. One done. Maybe we can like be like Maria and the sound of music and make clay clothes out of them. The sound of music, you say? Dope. A deer, a female deer. Ray! A drop of golden sun. Me! A name I call myself. Hey! <laughs> I don't really know the song. <laughs> now that we have cut the curtains, in half, now we're going to cut them in half again. There's Kevin trying to find an easier way of cutting this. <laughs> Which, you know, this way kind of makes a lot more sense. I guess the hard thing is, is trying to keep the edges together. Look at him. <laughs> Getting in his knitting bag, his old lady knitting bag. What? Get pins. Pins? 
Like safety pins? Sure. I don't think so. Like sewing pins. <laughs> It's fine, I'll just stay right here. Look in your pocket. Don't really have pockets. Found it. Where was it? <laughs> this is my pocket. <laughs> sewing machine. Thank goodness Kevin took sewing classes because all the stuff he's doing right now to the sewing machine. I would have no idea. I would just be pressing the button on the bottom and letting it move. Tell us what you're doing. He's threatening the machine. <laughs> <laughs> now what does this thing do with it? This is, it'll collect a chunk of this uh -huh. so that when you're sewing it goes down and this is what it catches to your button. Oh, so right now you're just like loading the mm -hmm. spool. What's nice too is the colored thread that was already in it when I, we took it out of the box is a perfect color. Not that anybody cares. I think you turn it down. At least I know that much. Seriously? <laughs> What'd you do? Just had to click a button. No, you have to oh, you just had to do it. <laughs> well, at least we read the instructions, right? <laughs> Are what are you going to do right now? Could be sewing a pillowcase. <laughs> I know, you're not good at this. You're supposed to be like, now I'm going to pin the sides. Now I'm going to pin the sides. Technically, I'm just getting my measurements of this. Because the one who cut it didn't cut that straight. So I have to make sure. Lies, 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 Vanelli! He's pattern blind. Not pattern blind, just want to make sure I get what you want. Exactly. Look at that. Such a great partner in crime. Seven right now is pinning one inch. I don't want to sweat One of four done. Oh, looks nice. Look at that. That's, uh... Get to stuffing. Here's what we bought to stuff it with. We're going to see if just one will fill it. <laughs> Oh, well. 
ladder stitch. Well, ladder <laughs> stitch. I thought you said a lot of stitch. I was like, yeah, there's probably a lot of stitches yet. But... <laughs> final touch we needed to complete our full home renovation DIY of our dining room. Time to stay boys! Excellent! If you've liked our videos, please like and subscribe. Also visit us on Instagram and TikTok at the Pines Estate Boys. Again, that's at the Pines Estate Boys on Instagram and TikTok. See you later. Bye. Smoke on. Poof. We're still here. <laughs>